Hey fellow Etsy sellers, welcome back to our channel. For today's video, we are going to walk you through the process of changing your bank account information on Etsy. Whether you've switched banks or need to update your payment details for any reason, we've got you covered. But before we dive into all of it, make sure you hit the subscribe button below and ring the notification bell so you never miss out on our latest content. Basically, if you are having a second thoughts on changing bank account on etsy for any reason you know say if you've changed your primary bank and you'll need to update your bank account information to ensure that your funds are deposited into your new account or maybe your bank account is closed for any reason such as due to um, any um, suspicious activity you'll need to provide the new bank account information to continue receiving payments and from etsy all right so how do we do that right here i am using google chrome right now on etsy.com but if you are using a different type of browser such as safari opera firefox or brave it's okay log in using your credentials and you might want to hover here on your account and then if you have this is the fun part here if you already have a store linked to your etsy.com you will be able to find the shop manager dashboard here okay or on your personal account go here and credit cards right since i don't have my shop basically I don't have any store opened or live account linked to my etsy so i can't uh, really um move forward but it's okay because we have a very helpful article here in the help center which is on how to update and verify your bank account for etsy payment deposits all right so you don't have to worry uh, okay, so now what we should do is step one to update your bank details. Okay, you might want to go and here on select shop manager. I can move forward because I don't have a store, but moving forward, if you're using the IT select, select, set seller app, select more, choose finances. All right, and then last is select payment settings. Once you've selected the payment settings, uh, use Blade's instant option to quickly verify your details by entering your online banking username and password, or use Blade's manual option to verify your bank with a test deposit after entering your bank account and routing numbers. Now, we also have an, an option here to add and verify your bank details instantly with Blade, right? So you can only select add or connect your bank with plate and once the uh, the plate pop up confirm that you've got the right name on file with your bank choose instant to log in with their online banking username and password okay now if you're using a mobile device you may be asked to verify your bank by signing into your bank's mobile app right and then if you're able to uh, verify your plates instant option this means your bank approved plate as a partner okay now if you don't have any access to online banking please call your bank directly to help identifying the uh, required three letter code because once you've seen a deposit in your bank account you want to need to enter the three letter code okay so i suggest you go here at the help center to read and understand all of the information i think which is going to be helpful really and that's it for today's video thanks for watching and i'll see you all in the next one